New details tonight. Port Clinton's fire chief Kent Johnson is now on paid administrative leave. It's over allegations that he sexually harassed and assaulted a woman. Michael Sandlin has been looking into the court records. Michael, what did you find out about this woman and these allegations? Well, Melissa, we know that she is a woman who works for the department. We won't name her to protect her privacy, but she has filed a protection order against Johnson and Ottawa County's Common Police Court. The 19 page document outlines months of alleged stalking and sexually oriented offenses, all by the chief. For 31 years, Kent Johnson has worked for the city of Port Clinton's fire department and the woman accusing him of crimes against her is someone he's known almost as long. Court documents show the woman has known the chief since she was seven and has worked for him since she was 15. In the 19-page protection order filed against Johnson, the woman claims his alleged inappropriate behavior towards her started with sexual references at work, but escalated to physical acts by October of 2022, while she was laid up after a back surgery, completely unable to move. Johnson allegedly showed up to her home, and once inside started groping her and trying to force himself on her. The court documents go on to show, during this initial assault, Johnson also allegedly flashed a gun at her. The woman claims Johnson continued stalking her for months, waiting outside her home to make sure no one was around, and then coming inside, usually late at night, rubbing up and down her legs and feet while she asked him not to. Eventually, the woman recovered from her surgery, but says the assault continued inside the fire station. When he was with her, she says he would sometimes threaten to take his own life. The most recent alleged assault happened on May 23rd, again attempting to grope and kiss her. The court documents reveal at that point she stopped staying at her home and told her supervisor about the behavior, who relayed the complaint to the city's administrator on June 1st. Two days later on the 3rd, Johnson allegedly showed up to her home a final time, saying that he was, quote, done picking on her, unquote, and his behavior must have, quote, screwed her up. On June 6th, Johnson was placed on paid leave. A full hearing for the protection order will happen in front of an Ottawa County judge on July 7th. There's still no date yet for any criminal proceedings. Kent Johnson was hired by the city of Port Clinton in 1992 and was promoted to chief in 2008 and is currently still receiving his annual salary of $82,000. Reporting in studio, I'm Michael Sandlin for WTOL 11.